Okay, this how to video is going to show you how to use um, MCAD X from the Cadence PCB tools uh, and send a board file directly into SolidWorks. So traditionally there was methods such as ID, um, a DXF or IDF or even IDX that gives you the capability to kind of communicate with, uh, with SolidWorks and other MCAD tools such as Pro Engineer. So Cadence have introduced something called MCAD X which allows you to kind of uh, collaborate directly or, or communicate directly with SolidWorks. So this is going to be one of the, the most basic flows of, of how to export data from uh, a finished board. So I've got a, a board that's rooted and placed. If we go and look at a quick look at the 3D canvases of the Cadence PCB tools, you can see effectively there's my silk screens and my step models, all my vias, everything's placed and, and ready to go. Maybe I want to send this to my MCAD engineer so he can uh, assemble it in, in a case and, and check that type of thing. So what we can do is there's a there's a, a file export MCAD X, um, which gives me the, the capability to kind of set the data out here. Let's just uh, clear all the data, start again. So I'm going to just check the filters. So we can choose what objects actually get sent. So I don't want any of the keep outs. I don't want the vias. Maybe I want the or the via keep outs. Um, I want the pins. I want the vias to go. I don't want the key pin. Or any unplaced components, uh, and I don't want the placement groups. So that sorts the filter out. I want to make sure we include things like um, the 3D step models. I'm not going to worry about copper or silk screen layers for now, uh, and then I'm just going to do an export. And this effectively generates a file. So if I go to that directory, I've got this kind of this baseline MCADX Z file, um, which is the data that uh, SolidWorks is going to open. So if we go to SolidWorks, I can literally just go File, MCADX, and Import. Uh, there's the file that I want to import. And we'll click on Open, and let's see what it does. So it says, do I want to go and create an assembly? Yes, I do. So that's completed without warnings. You can see effectively I've got um, all the components have been placed. Both sides. So I'm good. I'm happy with that. That's generated all the, the relevant files, all the parts. Um, that's the basic import from uh, Kane's PCB tools using MCADX.